Premier League Enterprise Programme is a programme that aims to inform young people around the world of work and business, uh, and in particular building on uh, confidence, self-esteem, motivation and um, the essentials of business. So we started off, we started off with uh, four schools and we did a launch event uh, for the challenge. Um, we set the challenge, which was set by Richard Scudamore of the Premier League. Um, this year it was to raise uh, interest in America. We, had the four, we set the challenge to the four schools and they went away and worked on that challenge. We did three sessions at school with the, each school and then they came back to the, uh, compete in the club heat event at the start of December. Um, it's been a great day here at um, Bet365 Stadium. I feel like I've learned a lot. And it's going to help us progress towards the challenge. Hopefully we'll win. Hopefully. Hopefully, yeah. Um, I think it's been really fun today, uh, considering the fact we won as well, which is always a bonus. Got a free watch out of it. <laughs> <laughs> so it's a good experience overall. I think it helps with the teamwork as well, because mm. I know at least I'm not the most excited mm -hmm. for teamwork. I like to work on my own, but I think it's really helped working with other people yeah. for progressing further in the challenge. It gave us a bit of practice like working as a team so we can all win the entire competition. Yeah. <laughs> right, hello, um, we are St Thomas More Catholic Academy and today we're going to present to you our business plan for the challenge. And the amount of money that's being made, for example, in the US the industry is worth over $15 billion, which is a tremendously huge business opportunity. And that was last year as well, so it's very recent. So it was really difficult. I was doing a, a scoring as we went along out of 20, and I had them all between 17 and 19, so my scoring almost didn't help me, right, in the end. I was expecting the presentations would be a bit clunky and stuttery, but they were very smooth. I mean, you know, really good at answering questions. And I think also just the creativity. Lots of different ideas. We saw lots of different propositions, so really impressive from that side. I think it's fantastic. So many, so many times we see students in school maybe disengage with what they're learning, but this challenge gives them something real and practical to apply the things they learn in school to a real-life scenario that they're challenged with now and that they may well be challenged with in the future. We stay behind after school to like work out what we do. And it's pretty quick. Really. And we did, uh, we did some research too, like at the market, see if it would be profitable. And we decided that was the best idea. We also used a flat hierarchical structure so everyone got an equal say. We only went with the idea that everybody agreed on. It was, it was challenging at first, but once we got the general idea of where we wanted to go with it, it was very, well, I wouldn't say very easy. It wasn't as difficult to sort of plan out the fine details of it. It's almost like running a business. You see how much detail you have to go into, you have to research stuff, you have to see, you have to get the numbers, spreadsheets, all of that. Um, well, I started off with a group of very lovely young men, uh, but I've seen them blossom. They've become very organised, very business-like very credible future businessmen I think and um, they've seen a, a development in their skills, presentation, communication, organisation and their confidence has improved so much. I couldn't be more proud. Mm -hmm.